Hi, this is Patty Miner here to train you to do social retail with Modere. It's absolutely easy, but you have to do it over and over and over and get really good at the main things that you need to do every single day. First off, you need to set that goal. What goal do you want to make? How much money do you want to make? And figure it out exactly how many customers or social marketers you need to sign up to get that goal. Once you get that fixed in your head, then you can go for that goal and make sure that you talk to people every day, talk to people every day, talk to people every day. That's your job, is to talk to people and to be a friend to people. It's social, it's social retail. We're making friends. We're having a good time making friends and being so helpful and helping people with their pain points or their problems that they have in their lives. And you then you can make it rain. You can make it rain money. So you want to make sure that you keep doing these. And even if you mess up, even if you make a mistake, even if you do something wrong, I have made every mistake there is in the book and I've still been successful. So I know you can do this. Everybody can do this job if they just keep working at it and keep getting good at the main, main, goals. Okay, so let's set up a 90-day run. Now, if you have a microwave oven and you're trying to pop popcorn, you notice that you put the popcorn in for three minutes. Well, the first minute, the microwave oven is working just as hard as, as it is the second minute and the third minute, but you only hear one or two kernels popping the first minute and maybe a few other kernels popping the second minute. But that third minute, pop, 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 and you have a full bowl of popcorn. Well, in 90 days, you're working just as hard your first month and second month and third month, but sometimes you have to keep dripping on people and keep giving them information and keep helping them and, and you're learning in the process and there's a, there's, you know, you have to learn how to do it. And so as you're learning how to do it, you will get better and better and better so that by that third month of that 90 days, you will be pop, 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 pop and have a whole team. So let's, let's get going. Okay, so the first thing that you wanna do is get really good at the income producing activities. Now, this is making your list. You may need to go through memory joggers every day. You may need to go on Facebook or social media, any of the social media platforms. There's Instagram and LinkedIn and Alignable and, and Pinterest. There's a lot of different formats, but you need to get good at whatever your format is. And there's in person and there's people that you meet at your clubs and the, the groups that you belong to. So depending on how you want to do it, you might want to try all of them to see which one you're really good at. You might be really good at social media and you're not doing it right now. Or you might be really good at in-person and you're not doing it right now. Or you might be really good at sending videos and making videos and you're not doing that right now. So get good at different things to find out what you're good at, at the, which you're the best at. Okay, so um, with social media, you want to create curiosity and you want to post, oh my gosh, I lost weight, or oh, my friend lost weight, or oh my goodness, look, my skin looks better, or oh, I have whatever I found out. I just found out this, so, or my, uh, my gut is better, or I have, you know, whatever you have experienced, or whatever you have seen other people experience, share that, share that, share that, in your post, on your reels, whatever you, however you can do that, you can share that, or in person. And those curiosity, once somebody asks, comments, likes, anything, then you have to follow through, follow through, follow through. You have to talk to those people. You have to start conversations. If it's in social media, then it's in texting and messaging. And maybe you grab their email address and say, oh my goodness, I have something that can help you with that. What's your email? And then you send them that first email about the thing that you're talking about, whether it's weight loss or whether it's business opportunity or whether it's your collagen. So whatever their situation is, you send them that first email or you talk to them about that. Find out their mode of communication. Do they like to text? Do they like snail mail? Do they like to be in person? Do they like uh, to emails? Do they like social media messaging? So find out what their mode of communication is. Most likely, the mode of communication is the way that you met them. <laughs> so, so continue that. And I usually put it in my phone. I like to keep my phone, all my notes in my phone. So on the first name line, this is just a system that I use that's really good for me, for my list, 
how I can invite people. So you're making your list, you're inviting people. On my phone, I will put their first and last name on the first name line. On the second name line, I will put that they're uh, something about them or, well, usually I use the company line to put something about them, like they have arthritis or they have, you know, they just had a baby blessing or they're, they just had their first, you know, they're playing tennis or they're really into puppies. I don't know, whatever they're into, you like to make that note. So when they call you, you have something to talk about. You know what they're, uh, what they're into and you'll jog your memory of who that person is because you're going to talk to thousands of people. You have to keep track somehow. And so... Uh, this is how I do it. On my last name line, I usually put M for Modere, dash. If it's in Patty's pod, I put PP because they're in my customer pod, so I put PP. And then I put their ID number if they're a customer. If they're a customer, I want to know their ID number because if they call me and they want to place an order, I want to be able to text the company. This is their name and their ID. Please put in this order and make their auto ship for the 25th or whatever date they wanted. So sometimes I'm the customer service rep for my customers and my social marketers many times. So I do train them how they can text the company and, and give them a, a welcome text. And usually if they do that, they are very self-sufficient. But sometimes at the very beginning, they want to talk to you, ask you, fix their order and go, well, this didn't work. What else could I use? Sometimes you have to fix their order. So first off, you make your list. You are always updating your list and you should add at least five new people every day, every day, every day. So you're making that list. Then you have to find communications, ways that you're co uh, communicating with them, messaging back and forth, starting conversations, real life conversations, and look for the woo, the window of opportunity where you can inject where, oh my goodness, I have something that could help you with that. As soon as they start their organ recital or telling you the problems that they have with their organs and they're starting to say whatever's wrong with them, then you have something that can help you with that. What is your email? I'll send you the information. And sometimes people might not want to give you their email. And if that's the case, you can say, well, you know how when you put anything and search anything on Google, everybody wants to do their own research. You know, when you search anything on Google, sometimes the truth is on page 10. You have to dig down deep to find the truth. I will send you the truth. I will send you the double blind studies. I will send you the doctor's recommendations. I will send you the success stories in that first email. So that way they can feel like, oh, I don't have to search Google. I can just, oh, okay. So you're saving them a big, long Google search because everybody wants to search for themselves. They think they're going to do their own research. But a lot of that truth, like I say, is not until page 5, 10. You know, you have to dig down deep for truth sometimes because everybody can say anything on Google. So then you want to, to uh, follow up with them. And I usually keep a record. I have an old fashioned written planner that I write in and I write a note, follow up with Mary, so and so. So each day I have like a little list of people that I follow up with and, and I put them, you know, maybe a week later, two weeks. Did you read, did you see the email? Did you get the video? How, what do you think? Uh, sometimes they, sometimes they are really fast, really quick turnaround. They're like, okay, I want to order. How do I order? And you give them your link and then you, they, if you, you tell them a little bit. Sometimes you could drip on them and send them an email every single Monday. I have been sending out emails every Monday for 10 years now. And if you could send them an email every single Monday and they might not sign up for two years. My TV repairman did that. <laughs> anyway, and then he signed up five people into it. After two years of getting my emails, then him and his wife and aunts and uncles and everybody are on that. So it depends on uh, their timeline, when they need it, when they're talking about it. But as you keep giving them information all the time, either that they are following you on social media and you're posting in your stories or your reels, and they see that all the time coming up every once in a while, every once in a while, not all the time, but all, every once in a while, they see that it will go back into their memory. Oh yeah, they can fix this. Oh yeah, they could help me with that if I ever had that problem. And then when they have an aunt, uncle, sister, somebody at a party, I get a lot of people that sign up after Thanksgiving for some reason because everybody got together discussing and talking and around a dinner table and then they call me and say oh I have my two friends I was just or my two aunts that I was just at Thanksgiving with and they want to sign up because they need help so I, you know it's it's uh it's a it's a process that you're constantly 
talking to people. So don't expect that the first time you talk to somebody, they're just going to sign up and be so excited like you are <laughs> because they're in a different mode of life and they may have a bunch of vitamins they already bought and they're got to get rid of those first or whatever. And sometimes whatever their situation is always unique and you just go with it. You just go with it and help them to sign up. Now, as you're helping them to sign up, I, when you're looking for the window of opportunity and you say, oh, I have something that can help you with that, and you start talking them through the different products, which means you have to watch the videos and you have to know a little bit of information about what we do and what, we're, what we have to offer so that you have something to talk about. Then as you're talking about, or you connect them right in the beginning when you haven't watched all the videos and you don't know all the products, then you connect them in a three-way chat with your upline. That helps because then they can answer those questions and you're getting trained in the meantime. So as you're answering these questions and talking them through their lives and everything, then usually when they say something like, will this help my shoulder? Will this help my knee? Then you go, oh my gosh, oh my goodness, yes, you need this so badly. What what can I help you? Let's let's get this ordered for you. What is your shipping? My closing line is, what is your shipping address? That's easy. People give you their shipping address. Then they give you their your email and their cell phone and their birthday, and their uh, credit card and their their you know whatever. And the, you can sign them up as a customer. If they would like to put their credit card in, they can go in and you can talk them through. Okay, go in here and log in and then you can even talk them through while they're actually on the phone. So either way, depending on what they're happy with. I have a lot of friends who just want me to put in their order for them and then other people want to do it themselves. You just honor and respect everybody's free agency and everybody's what they want to do and the way they do it and just be a little open to them. Anyway, so... As you get their order in um, and you help them with their order, you want to upsell them to eight unique items because the eight unique items is the highest sales prices that we have. You know, if you have one to four items, you get 5% off. If you have five to eight items, five to seven items, you get 10% off. But if you have eight unique items, you get 15% off plus free shipping. That's the highest upsell. So you want to sell them on other products to add to their order. Even if they're the $6 hand wash and the $7 toothpaste and the $8 mouth rinse and the $7 uh, fresh space air freshener that doesn't hurt your nose, lungs, or endocrine system. And you can talk through a few little points of the extra items that they could add to their uh, eight items. And once they get the eight items, I you explain that on auto ship, when you're on the auto ship, which is, is called subscription, when you have a subscription, then you can get these savings. All the sales for social marketers and customers, same prices, same sales, is this upsell. Now with customers, their third month, they get double those savings. So 15 and 15% 15, 15 off and another 15% off plus free shipping. So as their loyalty grows and they're still on auto ship and they should make a 90 day commitment to the products anyway, because all the double blind studies were done in 90 days. So they should at least be on for three months. But by that third month, the products get cheaper and less expensive. So because they're on sale even more. So they want to build that loyalty. Well, what it, it's, it's really wonderful to help them. And then maybe the second month, you might help them with the, with the topical collection and maybe add something besides their collagen, their topical collection and some live clean products. If they have a pet, uh, if they want to lose some weight, if they, you can keep kind of adding, if they have gut problems and they want to have good nutrition with the golds, greens, and reds and their prebiotics. So you can keep making a perfect order, doing the math for them with your calculator, you know, figuring it out and saying, oh, you know what, you, it would only be this much. And sometimes it's the two bottles of collagen or whatever they wanted. It sometimes just to add a few inexpensive live clean items is less expensive than the one they had before, like like less expensive than the two bottles. Like I figured it up one time, it was $158 or something for the two bottles with tax and shipping. And when they got the extra items, it came to 142. So, I mean, they got extra free products and they saved money. So it's, it's, 
it's a win-win for them to learn how to use extra products. And then most of my customers will stay on that eight products, eight products, eight products. And I always tell them, don't be so worried about subscription because a lot of other companies, when they get you on auto ship, you never get off. Like you can't hardly find a way to get off. But this is easy. The company will text you three days before they ever charge your card so you could maybe change your order. Because I haven't had the same order in 10 years. I order something different every single month. So, and then I teach them how they can text or call the company or go online to change their order. And then they can change their order and say, maybe one month they want the tree biotic golds, greens, and reds. And then the next month they would like the cell proof serum and the body firming foam and the moisturizer. You know, maybe they're going to switch off the products because they last a little longer and then fill it up with maybe a little hand wash or something if they need one or two more items. So, and the hand wash and the dish soap and all of the Live Clean products are wonderful gifts they can give away. If they get a bunch of them and they say, oh, I already have three dish hand washes. I go, well, does, do you, does your friend have a birthday? Well, then give it to them because nobody's allergic to it. There, there's thousands of toxins they leave out of this. So it's, it's very safe and natural. So it's wonderful. So give it as a gift. All these things, if they have extra of the little uh, things, they got it for free anyway, so give it away as a gift and give it somebody a happy birthday or something. So um, they always, I upsell them always to the eight unique items plus free shipping. And then you want to always follow through with them and make sure that you uh, help them to feel good about their products. You might want to check and see how, how are you doing and maybe adjust their order a little bit the second month or the third month. So follow through, follow through, follow through. Make sure you list, make your list every day, every day, every day. Invite and find the window of opportunity that you can start those conversations and find how you can invite them to either our opportunity as a business opportunity or our products. And then you close, you find out how to close them. Oh, what's your shipping? <laughs> That's my close. And then, and then upsell them to the eight unique items. And and or to the if they want to be a social marketer then you tell them about the four hundred dollar kit so there's there's ways to do this and you need to do it every day every day this is your schedule i actually set my alarm clock for an hour at a time or 90 minutes at a time or two hours at a time depending on okay i have two hours right now and i to prevent scrolling i make sure that i don't get stuck on a kitty video or watching a dolphin or something you know that, that are is you know you might go wow that's amazing oh wow that's amazing and you can get sidetracked and distracted so don't get distracted make sure that you're right in there make a note in front of you uh, whatever you have to do to say I'm making conversations I'm making conversations I'm making following conversations I'm following through this is my work this is my time people are my work so making friends taking care of people making them happy and helping them is your business and I hope that we are going to just be so good together and you just have to do the work it will you'll get good at it you'll get good at it even if you're scared just have that 90 seconds of insane courage to just go to that person that you look up to and say do you want to do this business with me or just just if you have a feeling in your heart to to say or do something do it do that because that will help you to succeed and i'm so excited to join you in this journey